So, Andrew, tell us a little bit about Generation One and the initiative. Okay, it's movement across all Australia, you know, and the great thing is every person in Australia, boy or girl, mum or dad, work it, dance it, doesn't matter. Every one of us can come together and say, listen, we can make a difference. Now, it starts, of course, in your own heart. You make a decision here that we're going to remove the disparity in our generation. Once you've made that decision, you then take the small steps it takes. You hop on that Generation One website, you type in who you are, there's steps there you can choose as to how you want to support this campaign. Press the send button. You are eliminating the disparity by that very step. Then if you wish to, you can come with us on this short journey where governments of Australia, corporations of Australia, Indigenous people across Australia say, enough's enough. We're going to do well for out of a job. We're going to eliminate the disparity. Fantastic. And when you say movement, what's the difference between movement and campaign? I suppose a movement has a huge objective at the end of it. And this movement has this high class problem we have created. All of us working together so far as employers of Australia, we're heading for 50,000 guaranteed jobs available to Indigenous people. We're currently sitting at over 20,000. We've come through the global financial crisis and week in, week out, employees came on and committed to employ Indigenous people, even through the depths of, that, of, of, of those times. Now we're coming into better times and the employers are really stepping up. They're doing what they can and that creates, for the first time, a demand to employ Indigenous people. You get Indigenous people into those jobs, you don't have a disparity anymore. We've solved the disparity, but of course what we've done is actually challenge the rest of Australia to join us on this journey. Because a guaranteed jobs is the end goal. Now we need training to match those jobs. We need education to match that training and we need an environment where kids and young men and women want that education, know that that training is relevant to them and they're guaranteed that job. The welfare goes with the disparity. The disparity is gone. Fantastic. So what would be a message that you would send out to um, Indigenous people in rural communities about this initiative? Absolutely believe in yourself. You are an Aboriginal. You are such a wonderful, worthy Australian that the rest of this country wants to give you the opportunity we have all had. Me personally, I know the more you get to know Aboriginal people, the more you love them. And I say to every Indigenous person in this country, we absolutely believe in you. We're creating opportunities. Please lead by your own actions.